Hello guys, Nelson Virgil from ExcelMail.com. I'm here to talk to you about something that you may be concerned about. You probably have seen news online, on TV, in different areas and magazines that say that testosterone can increase the chances of heart attacks and they should probably not take it or probably stop it. I'm here to tell you that those statements were based on two, at least two to three large studies that were done wrongly. Studies, these studies provided testosterone to men with or without prior history of heart disease. They did not follow them. They did not remeasure testosterone after they started treatment. They did not measure hematocrit, estradiol, which are two factors that are linked to high risks if not well uh, managed. And they basically did not retest men to see if they were actually complying and adhering to testosterone replacement. The FDA has actually justified and reviewed all the studies and has actually concluded that the studies were flawed. However, we were surprised to see the FDA recently make a statement, send out a notice to doctors and the media about the increased risk of cardiovascular disease in men taking testosterone. Even after they reviewed all the studies and they actually replied to a petition in which they said, None of the studies were done correctly. Yes, we may need more data, but we don't have the data yet. The testosterone, the FDA, and the researchers are actually recruiting into other studies. But as it stands, testosterone replacement therapy, if you need it, if you have low testosterone blood levels, has not been proven to increase your cardiovascular disease uh, risks. And it has actually uh, proven, if you replace your testosterone, to decrease your cardiovascular disease uh, risks. So right now, I would say, do not listen to these messages. They're based on flawed data, and let's wait for more data to come through. Don't stop your testosterone replacement therapy, especially without talking to your doctor. And if your doctor is misinformed about cardiovascular disease and testosterone replacement, please send them some of the fact sheets and information on this subject on excelmail.com. Thank you.